Hello guys, if you're running into this error while installing Windows 10 or 11, where it says, Windows can't be installed on this drive, and when you click on Show Details, you'll see the message, Windows cannot be installed on this disk. And even if you try creating a new partition, or deleting the old one, the error doesn't go away. So, in this video, I'm going to show you two methods to fix this issue. The first method uses Command Prompt. To open it, press Shift plus F10 key on your keyboard, and if that doesn't work, try Function plus Shift plus F10 key. That will open the Command Prompt window here. Now type the command Disk Part and press Enter, then type List Disk and press Enter. This will show you all your storage drives. Now, select the hard drive where you want to install Windows. Keep in mind, this will completely wipe your data, so only use this method if you don't have anything important stored or you've already backed it up. If you're okay with that, type clean and press enter, then type convert MBR and press enter. This will convert your drive to MBR, and in most cases, that should let you install Windows. But as you'll see on my system, Sometimes this still doesn't solve the problem. If that happens, don't worry. The second method I'll show you is much safer and it will work 100%. For the second method, we'll recreate the bootable USB. First, unplug it from the computer where you're installing Windows and plug it into another computer. This time, we'll make a few small adjustments while creating the new bootable USB. For this, we'll use the Rufus application, which you can download from the official Rufus website. Once you have, open Rufus, then select your Windows ISO file. Then, under Partition Scheme, choose MBR. And under File System, select NTFS. After applying these settings, click Start. Rufus will create a bootable USB with the MBR Partition Scheme and format it to NTFS. Once the process is complete, insert the USB back into the system All right, after booting from the USB and letting the Windows set up load, you can see the issue is finally resolved. The Windows can't be installed on this drive. Error is gone. Hopefully one of these methods worked for you. And if it did, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel for more Windows fixes. I'll catch you in the next video.